together in church. Thanks to the wonders of modern technology, we come together virtually as the family of God in our Father's presence to celebrate the great festival of Christmas. In this service, led by the Lincoln Catholic Deanery Virtual Choir, we hear and receive the good news of the birth of Christ, and we offer to God our thanksgiving in the joyful singing of carols. As we gather together in the name of Christ, we pray for the world he came to save, for the church, that it may be enabled in our generation to surrender anew to God's holy wisdom and to bear the good news of God's love to a needy world. For the world, which is already Christ's, that all its peoples may recognise their responsibility for its future, and may be inspired by the message of Christmas to work together for the establishment of justice, freedom and peace everywhere. 
for those working over the festive period to provide essential services and care and for those continuing to develop a vaccine against COVID-19 that Christ will give them the grace and strength they need to make their efforts fruitful. For all in special need, the sick, the anxious, the lonely, the fearful and the bereaved, that the peace and light of the Christ child may bring hope and healing to all who sit in darkness. So as we commence our worship, we commend all whom we love or who have asked for our prayers to the unfailing mercy of our Heavenly Father and say together, as Christ himself taught us, Our Father, who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us and lead us not into temptation but deliver us from evil.
And the angel of the Lord called unto Abraham out of heaven the second time, and said, By myself have I sworn, saith the Lord, for because thou hast done this thing, and hast not withheld thy son, thine only son, that in blessing I will bless thee, and in multiplying I will multiply thy seed as the stars of the heaven, and as the sand which is upon the seashore. And thy seed shall possess the gate of his enemies, and in thy seed shall all the nations of the earth be blessed, because thou hast obeyed my voice. The Word of the Lord. The people that walked in darkness have seen a great light. They that dwell in the land of the shadow of death, upon them hath the light shined. For unto us a child is born, unto us a son is given, and the government shall be upon his shoulder, and his name shall be called Wonderful, Counselor, the Mighty God, the Everlasting Father the Prince of Peace. Of the increase of his government and peace there shall be no end. Upon the throne of David, and upon his kingdom, to order it, and to establish it with judgment, and with justice, from henceforth even for ever. The zeal of the Lord of hosts will perform this. The Word of the Lord. Oh, 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 oh,
face shall come forth a rod out of the stem of Jesse, and a branch shall grow out of his roots, and the Spirit of the Lord shall rest upon him, the Spirit of wisdom and understanding, the Spirit of counsel and might, the Spirit of knowledge and of the fear of the Lord, and shall make him of quick understanding in the fear of the Lord. With righteousness shall he judge the poor, and reprove with equity for the meek of the earth. The wolf also shall dwell with the lamb, and the leopard shall lie down with the kid, and the calf and the young lion and the fatling together, and a little child shall lead them, and the cow and the bear shall feed, their young ones shall lie down together, and the lion shall eat straw like the ox. And the suckling child shall play on the hole of the asp, and the weaned child shall put his hand on the cockatrice den. They shall not hurt nor destroy in all my holy mountain, for the earth shall be full of the knowledge of the Lord, as the waters cover the sea. The Word of the Lord. The angel Gabriel from heaven came, his wings as drift as snow, his eyes as flame. All hail, says he, the lonely maiden Mary, most highly favoured lady, And in the sixth month, the angel Gabriel was sent from God unto a city of Galilee named Nazareth, to a virgin espoused to a man, whose name was Joseph of the house of David. And the virgin's name was Mary. And the angel came in unto her and said, Hail, thou that art highly favoured, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women. And when she saw him, she was troubled at his saying, and cast in her mind what manner of salutation this should be. And the angel said unto her, Fear not, Mary, for thou hast found favour with God. And behold, thou shalt conceive in thy womb, and bring forth a son, and shalt call his name Jesus. He shall be great, and shall be called the Son of the Highest, and the Lord God shall give unto him the throne of his father David, and he shall reign over the house of Jacob for ever, and of his kingdom there shall be no end. Then Mary said unto the angel, How shall this be, seeing I know not a man? And the angel answered and said unto her, The Holy Ghost shall come upon thee, and the power of the highest shall overshadow thee, and therefore 
also that holy thing which shall be born of thee shall be called the Son of God. And Mary said, Behold, the handmaid of the Lord, be it done unto me according to thy word. And the angel departed from her. The word of the Lord. Gaudete, gaudete, Christos es natus, ex Maria Virginae, gaudete, 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 Christos es natus, ex Maria Virginae, gaudete, tempus ad es gratiae, hoc por octavamus, camina leticiae, devote redamus, Christus es natus, ex Maria Virginae, gaudete, 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 Christus es natus, ex Maria Virginae, gaudete, Deus homo factus est, natura mirante, mundus renovatus est, a Christo regnante, gaudete, gaudete, Christus es natus, ex Maria Virginae, gaudete, 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 Christus es natus, ex Maria Virginae, gaudete, es a celis porta, clausa per transito, unde lux es tota, salus in plenito, gaudete, gaudete, Christus es natus, ex Maria Virginae, gaudete, 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 Christus es natus, ex Maria Virginae, gaudete, ego nostro consio, salatiam in lustro, benedicat domino, salus regi nostro, gaudete, gaudete, Christus es natus, ex Maria Virginae, gaudete, 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 Christus es natus, ex Maria Virginae, gaudete, and it came to pass in those days that there went out a decree from Caesar Augustus that all the world should be taxed, and all went to be taxed, every one into his own city. And Joseph also went up from Galilee out of the city of Nazareth into Judea unto the city of David, which is called Bethlehem, because he was of the house and lineage of David to be taxed with Mary, his espoused wife, being great with child. And so it was, that while they were there, the days were accomplished that she should be delivered. And she brought forth her firstborn son, and wrapped him in swaddling clothes, and laid him in a manger, because there was no room for them in the inn. The word of the Lord.
And there were in the same country shepherds abiding in the field, keeping watch over their flock by night. And lo, the angel of the Lord came upon them, and the glory of the Lord shone round about them, and they were sore afraid. And the angel said unto them, Fear not, for behold, I bring you good tidings of great joy, which shall be to all people. For unto you is born this day in the city of David a Saviour, which is Christ the Lord, and this shall be a sign unto you. You shall find the babe wrapped in swaddling clothes, lying in a manger. And suddenly there was with the angel a multitude of the heavenly host praising God and saying, Oh. 
In the beginning was the Word, and the Word was with God, and the Word was God. The same was in the beginning with God. All things were made by him, and without him was not anything made that was made. In him was life, and the life was the light of men. And the light shineth in darkness, and the darkness comprehended it not. There was a man sent from God, whose name was John. The same came for a witness, to bear witness of the light, that all men through him might believe. He was not that light, but was sent to bear witness of that light. That was the true light, which lighteth every man that cometh into the world. He was in the world, and the world was made by him, and the world knew him not. He came unto his own, and his own received him not. But as many as received him, to them gave he power to become the sons of God, even to them that believe on his name, who were born not of blood, nor of the will of the flesh, nor of the will of man, but of God. And the word was made flesh, and dwelt among us, and we beheld his glory, the glory as of the only begotten of the Father, full of grace and truth. The Word of the Lord. Come to 
as our service draws to a close, sure you'd like to join me in thanking the members of the Lincoln Catholic Deanery Virtual Choir for leading us through this act of worship today. As we return to our various activities at home, we ask God's blessing. The Lord be with you. And may the joy of the angels, the eagerness of the shepherds, the perseverance of the wise men, the obedience of Joseph and Mary, and the peace of the Christ child be yours this Christmas. And may Almighty God bless you all, the Father and the Son and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Let us be in the peace of Christ. Thanks be to God.